What's going on, guys? Josh Brown over here with Texas Boat World. I'm out here, Dana Peak Park. I don't know if you've been out here in a while, but would you look at this? Just look at it. Guys, our lake is full. As of nine o'clock this morning, we were a foot down. And we've still got probably uh, God, at least another foot or better coming in. So we'll be at full or over. Belton this morning was five foot over. Um, so that's awesome news. Means we got full lakes to get out there and enjoy ourselves. And that's going to be great. However, as you can see, we got one of the park attendants over here. Uh, with this blessing comes a little bit of a curse. You are going to have a lot of debris to deal with. So... Being out there, and I'm going to run out here in a minute. I've actually got a boat we just traded for that I'm going to take out and uh, run a little bit uh, to use to kind of show if I can find some of the stuff out there that you got to watch for and just show you the lake because you probably hadn't seen it like this in a while. But we got docks in the water. Beaches are going to be back. This is good news. All right, guys, as you can see, I'm out here and I'm already in about 30 foot of water, but I ain't too far from the ramp. But if you look, and we got stuff floating everywhere, everywhere. Uh, it's going to take it a few days to clear out. This stuff will find its way to a bank. But just know we're out here right now. And if it, just because it looks like it's clean water, it looks like you're in deep enough water, it does not mean that you are. So if you aren't familiar with the lake or you, you ain't got a good eye, take it easy. All right? Give this stuff a chance to find a home. Give this stuff a chance to get out of your way. And then get out here and enjoy the lake. But a lot of this probably never going to notice but i promise you somewhere in here there's a log that you're going to hit it's going to eat up that lower unit might not even notice until you come off the water just be careful All right, guys, just stop to test some of this stuff out. And as you can see right there in front of me, that is just a log sitting in the water. That one's obviously large enough to see that you'd be aware of. There's bound to be some of that not above the water like that. And definitely... Definitely not that big and visible above the water. Just be careful. But look at this. Everything is up. We're full. I give this place a week to settle. You're going to be in a good way if you just take the time, learn your lake, get out here. gonna we're trolling back in here idling back in just because the amount of debris out here you can see it all out there you still see top of your old gone orchard or whatever that was over there but last time final time just be careful out here for a few days don't make any assumptions Look, look at that guy right there. Boy, that is a prop killer right there. That joker would take care of every problem you had on that lower unit because you'd be putting a new one on there. 
So, get yourselves ready. Folks, we're back. We're back in business for this pleasure boating season. Just gonna take a couple days.